Hey, uh, hello YouTube. Um, this is a walkthrough on how to fix the latch on your uh, Dodge Grand Caravan liftgate. This is a 2012. It's got an automatic liftgate with a button you know, inside the liftgate that you push to open and close it, and the button on the remote and above the steering wheel. Um, what happened? The, the circumstances aren't important, but basically what happened was that this got manually closed because there's no other good place to be able to attach something to this to be able to uh, close it. So this was manually pushed up. You just heard it click and saw me push it with a screwdriver. And then, and what's happened is as it was being pushed, there's a little latch, spring-loaded latch in there and a detente, and that thing latched into place right there. That's still not enough to be able to tie something on it because it'll slip it off. But this would prevent it from closing automatically because it would get into the closing position and this would already be blocking the latch at the bottom. So this is manually pushed the rest of the way up like that. Now you could tie a string through that and you could loop it down to the normal latch that this thing is secured to. But what's happened is that there's a little detente up there and a spring-loaded catch. And in order to fix this, what you're going to need if you have to deal with this issue is at, one, is at least one long flat-bladed thin screwdriver with a long blade. So this one here you can see is pretty long. It's got a thin tip and a flat blade. You'll need that to push this latch out of the way. You notice that it's moved now. The regular, that little catch, that little latch has moved out of the way and the regular lift gate latch has slotted up. So you've got to push that spring-loaded catch all the way out. There's a little bit of a bump here on the latch which you could get to and turn this or you'll need another screwdriver to be able to get in here and pull this down part way into the second position. So I'm bumping my camera here. That's got to be pushed out of the way. Then you've got to get in here and pull the latch down. The first time that happens, you're going to get caught in that halfway position again, which won't let the lift gate close. Basically, this is a dumb latch with smart electronics. And if this thing is closed, when it's already trying to close and it thinks it's open, it's just going to bump on the, on the main catch for the gate and stop, thinking that there's an obstruction and it needs to stop for safety, at which point it's in manual mode and you're basically in trouble at that point. The same is true with this closed the other half of the way. The catch or the issue here is that now this is harder to get to that spring-loaded latch. So you're going to actually have to close this part way to get that latch out of the way, and I'm going to get the camera to move back just a little bit, and that gives you enough to get a thin bladed flat screwdriver up in here and push that spring-loaded latch the rest of the way out of the way. And once you do that, you should be able, and I'm going to have to move over here a little bit to get some better leverage on this, once you can get a blade up in there, there we go and move that up out of the way, then you can get in here, turn that back the rest of the way, and now, here it goes with the remote. This, that same works whether you hit the button inside the car uh, at the back or the front. The latch is in the appropriate position. As it goes down there, you hear it catch. Voila. So for about 10 or 15 minutes, depending on how long it takes you to find the necessary screwdrivers and a bit of uh, messing about to, to do this, you can uh, take care of this latch yourself. If all that's happened is you've manually, manually put it in the closed position when the electronics think that it should be open. Uh, be careful because that latch is spring-loaded. I'm pretty sure it's metal, but I wouldn't guarantee that. It might be plastic. And obviously don't force any of this stuff. You've got to be able to get that spring-loaded latch that's up in here, pushed well out of the way before you rotate the primary main catch, that little flat circular piece with a notch in it. Hope this helps. Good luck.